Looking to buy a new car? Well, hold on to that check. For 2019, we'll see the arrival of a number of new offerings. Our list of SUVs that will be hitting Indian shores in 2019 continues, starting with the Ford Endeavour facelift. This might not look too different from the current car, but look closely and there are some minor changes. This facelift gets minor exterior styling tweaks on the front with an updated grille, bumper and redesigned alloy wheels. On the inside, it will get slightly revised interiors. Although there is a new engine available overseas, the current engine lineup that includes a 2.2-litre diesel and a 3.2-litre diesel will remain on sale for now. The Endeavour will take on the likes of the Toyota Fortuna, Mitsubishi Pajero Sport and the Isuzu MUX. BMW X4 First up from BMW in 2019 will be the new X4. The new model is noticeably larger than the X3, which is the model it is based on. There will be two engine options on offer at launch, the X-Drive 30i, which employs a 2-litre 4-cylinder petrol, and the X-Drive 30d, which is powered by a 3-litre 6-cylinder diesel, and both models will get all-wheel drive as standard, along with an 8-speed automatic gearbox. BMW X2 Designed to appeal to a younger audience, the BMW X2 has a unique exterior design largely unchanged from that of the concept X2. As with the second generation X1, the X2 is based on BMW's UKL platform. Under the bonnet, there will likely be a 2.0-litre petrol that drives the front wheels and a 2.0-litre diesel with all-wheel drive. The petrol engine is mated to a 7-speed dual-clutch automatic while the diesel gets an 8-speed torque converter. Mercedes-Benz GLC facelift. For 2019, the GLC will get restyled LED headlights and bumpers, along with a tweak grille, a dual touchpad interface for the infotainment on the steering wheel, and a sleeker, high-resolution infotainment screen. It could also get the new 2.0-litre diesel engine seen on the C-Class facelift. BMW X7. BMW 7-seat Mercedes-Benz GLS rival, the X7, will be the brand's largest SUV yet. It will come with three rows of seats and will sit alongside the 7 Series in the BMW lineup. Inside, it will feature a new screen-based instrument panel. On offer will be a 340-horsepower, 3.0-litre straight-six turbo petrol in the X-Drive 40i, a 265-horsepower, 3.0-litre straight-six turbo diesel in the X-Drive 30d, and a sporty quad turbocharged 3 litre inline six cylinder diesel that produces 400 horsepower and a colossal 760 newton meters of torque in the M50T. All variants of the X7 will come with an eight speed automatic gearbox and four wheel drive. BMW X5. Along with the new platform that's shared with the upcoming X7, the new X5 is bigger, has updated powertrains, and features BMW's latest digital cockpit and infotainment functions in a more luxurious cabin. Under the hood, a six-cylinder petrol and two six-cylinder diesel engines will be available to begin with. The X5 will also have, on offer, an optional third row of seats. Audi Q8 Audi's flagship SUV, the Q8, isn't signed off for India, but it's under consideration. The Q8 features a coupe-like roofline and frameless doors. Notable styling flourishes include bulging wheel arches inspired by the famous Quattro and the option of 22-inch wheels. The Q8 is likely to be available with a choice of two 3.0-litre engines, a 340-horsepower petrol in the 55 TFSI and a 286-horsepower diesel in the 50 TDI. Audi Q3 Audi's second-generation Q3 is scheduled to come to India in 2019. In terms of design, the front end of the new Q3 is clearly inspired by the flagship Q8 SUV. There's more equipment on offer on the new Q3 as well. Abroad, the entry-level Q3 will be powered by a 150-horsepower, 1.5-litre turbo petrol engine. The 2-litre turbo petrol will be offered in two states of tune, 190 and 230 HP. The 2.0-litre diesel also gets two states of tune, 150 HP in the 35 TDI and 190 HP in the 40 TDI. Jeep Wrangler The Jeep Wrangler has been given a complete overhaul, but with minimal, truly subtle styling changes, it retains its iconic design and off-road capability. Also new to the Wrangler are two four-cylinder engines, a new 2.0-litre turbo petrol and a 2.2-litre turbo diesel. And it is possible India could get these new powertrains along with an 8-speed automatic transmission. For those seeking even more power, the 3.6-litre V6 petrol and 3.0-litre diesel are also likely to be offered. And since it will continue to be manufactured in the US and will only be shipped as a CBU, 
you, it will continue to be one pricey Jeep. Mercedes-Benz GLE. It looks more muscular and in this all-new form, the Mercedes-Benz GLE will get, for the first time ever, seats for seven and an advanced suspension system that Mercedes claims surpasses even that found on its S-Class flagship. Engine options are likely to include a 3.0-litre V6 petrol and a V6 diesel, along with a 2.0-litre four-cylinder diesel, all mated to a 9-speed automatic gearbox. Porsche Macan facelift. For 2019, Porsche will bring in the Macan facelift. While the changes on the outside are minimal, it will get more features on the inside, including an updated infotainment system, and there will be a set of new and more powerful engines to choose from. So that wraps up our list of the SUVs that will be coming to the Indian market in 2019. Do stick around for our other videos, which will showcase the sedans, hatchbacks, MPVs, sports cars, hybrid and electric vehicles.